Well, police say they preyed on seniors to buy cars tonight. Two people are arrested. Five more are wanted in a fraud ring. Detectives say the suspects stole info from more than a dozen seniors across the state, some of them more than 90 years old. News Six's Molly Reed is in Daytona Beach, where officers say there could be more victims. Police say right now they've identified 13 victims and think there could be over 70 more. Several of these victims they say are over the age of 90, so these are crimes the chief was visibly upset about this morning. So for these suspects to prey specifically on our elderly, two of which are deceased, is just, it's reprehensible. Chief Chikara Young says these seven suspects from DeLand stole personal information and used it to buy $350,000 worth of cars from Daytona Beach Kia. Police coining the investigation Operation Soul Stingers, named after the cars they bought illegally. I think a lot of this stuff was recovered just based off of documents, but we're not sure exactly how they obtain the documents with, with the personal information. But once they got that information, the chief says they used the state's online highway safety database to change the victim's addresses and make fake IDs to buy the cars. He says they also opened bank accounts, bought phones, applied for unemployment, and COVID small business loans in the victim's names. At some point, they all responded to the Kia dealership with fake identification to purchase a vehicle. Police say the ringleader Drayton McMillan and Jennifer Polgar have been caught, but they're still looking for Shaquildra Johnson and Thomas Taylor Jr., Eric Gilbert, Shatiqua Burson, and Freddie Farley. They're all facing fraudulent use of identification and organized scheme to defraud charges. Indian some criminals have morals, so when you stoop so low as that you go after our most vulnerable, charges should definitely be enhanced. Now, right now, police say most of these victims are actually from South Florida. The investigation that kicked off, they say after one person noticed a strange charge on their credit reports, the chief says let this serve as a reminder that no matter your age or position in life, to regularly check your credit. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County, I'm Molly Reed getting results, News 6.